It's real Tuama Cars Cribs, and I'm back with another one. Huge shout out to everybody tuning into this video. And if you aren't subscribed, make sure you smash that subscribe button. You see the title, you see the thumbnail. Today we're doing DoorDash. This is something I've never done before. So I'm gonna let you guys know my honest opinion on if I think I would do it again or not. And not only that, we're doing it in the Vettachini. So if you like this video, smash that like button. And if you are subscribed again, make sure you smash that subscribe button. Our first pickup is at Jewel Osco in Gurney, Illinois. The whole trip is gonna be four and a half miles and we're gonna get paid $6 to do it. So we're gonna go in here, grab the stuff, and I'll see you guys when we get out the store. Boom, we secured the bags. The bags are on the back seat. What actually happened while we were in the store, another one came up. So we're just gonna to try to kill two birds and one stone. It's added an extra $3. So we're gonna to try to get this so we can get this hot $9. I'm about to get this $9. So I see you guys when we drop off our first order and then on our way to the second order. So you guys wanna make sure you, oh, that's my guy. One of my vet bros right there. You know, he just waved at me. You know, that's the thing. Y'all don't know. I mean, if you got a vet, then you know. If not, then you don't know. But I see you guys when we get to the house. 36867. 36867. Pulled it up in this thing. 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, 36, but we dropped off the first one. That went very well. The lady liked the car. So hopefully they start tipping us more. Maybe they're going to tip us less because we're in this car. But we're going to see. We're on our way to the next one. So I'll turn the camera back on after that one. Then we're going to go back to the prime location and get that done. Pulling up to the second address. There we go right here. Oh, wow. Here we go. And they ain't gonna be able to see the car this time, so I don't know if I'm gonna get a reaction. But it's the second address, so we just made nine dollars real quick. Plus the base place. So I already don't know how this works, so I'm just gonna let you guys know. So we just got one to come in. I don't know if you guys can see that. Walmart 11 items, 3.2 miles for two dollars and seventy-five cents. I'm gonna decline that. It's not enough fettuccine. So I'll let you guys when the next one pop up. Ring a ring ring, another one. Six dollars and fifty cent. Go to Portillo's. Eleven point four miles. They are out of their mind. Decline that. Um, that's just too far. Eleven point four miles for for six fifty. That's that's not enough. Whamsky, we just got one. We're going to Walmart for one item. For four dollars and twenty-five cents, and how many miles? I forgot, but we're on our way to Walmart right now. So I'm gonna click this back on when we get back in the whip ski, baby. Goodness, money making these moves. We are here at Walmart getting the items. Well, it's only really one item, so I'm gonna let you guys know how this goes once we click back on this camera after we come from inside of Walmart getting this item. I know the, the video is not as best as it could be, not as good as it could be. I'm working on that. I'm, if I'm gonna start doing it, I'm gonna start doing it a little bit different. So this is actually my first time, so I don't really know what I'm really doing. I'm just doing it. That's the thing about life. When you wanna do something, just do it and figure out as you go. Don't try to wait and procrastinate and say, oh, well, I gotta think about this and oh, what about this and what about, forget it, fuck all that. Just start. Just start. That's all I want you to do. If you have a goal or you want to do something, just do it. Just start moving in that direction. Everything else is going to come along the way. Don't make no excuses. We want execution, no excuses. So make sure you guys keep that in mind. I know I'm giving you all a pep talk right now, but I hope this reached someone that really has been thinking and contemplating and procrastinating about doing something. Just do it. Don't worry about nothing else. Just do it. You wouldn't believe what this person's got. Come on, come on now, slow down, buddy. You wouldn't believe what this person bought. They just bought a box of candy, so they're doing all this for a box of candy. I'm not going A one dollar box of candy. That's the reason why they got this. Yeah, I'm turning right here. We are here to drop off the candy. 
<laughs> I can't believe somebody paid this money to go for some candy. They must really want this candy really bad. It's crazy. Now we're switching locations. We're getting closer to home. I know we ain't made no crazy money yet. But we're getting closer to home. So I want to switch locations. Because we had to go drop off the candy at a closer to home area. So that's where we're going now. So now we're going to go to buy this Walmart in Waukegan. We're going to go buy the Walmart and see what happens. We got a good one, guys. We got a good one from Denny's. So we have to go to Denny's, pick this order up, and it's literally a mile away for $5.25. So we're going to Denny's right now. To... Whip on that corner pretty fast, buddy. Going to Denny's to go pick up this order. I'm kind of wondering because like, I had to use the bathroom, but they don't get this money, baby. We got the bag. Now we're gonna go get the bag, the 525 to be exact. The one thing about this, this is actually the first time we actually even did a full one. So the other one, everything else was like a jewel. And what else did we do? And Walmart. So this is the first full one. And it's not that much food. So they must have been hungry. They're trying to get, they're trying to eat. And maybe they don't want to come out the house. So this is what we're gonna do. We're actually almost there. We'll be there in probably one or two minutes. So Less than a minute. We dropping off the food. Got that 525. That was less than a mile. That was sweet. So maybe I should stay around here for a little bit longer. But it's like it's like a, a it's like a give or take because someone from someone who ordered something from this area they may want to go all the way back to Gurney. Which is kind of considered Gurney, but it's Waukegan, but it's Gurney, but it's Waukegan. But you know, for those of you in the area, you kind of know what I'm talking about. But all we had to do was drop this off at the front desk. About to get that 525, baby. See what else pop up. Oh yeah, one more thing I forgot to tell you guys. The website is up. So if you want to redefine the met, redefine the brand merch, go to the website. The website is redefinedtb.com. Or you can send me an email, redefinedtb at gmail.com. We do have the pink R for breast care breast cancer awareness going on right now. We have the blue R, we have the red R, we have the all white letters. Just kind of if you want a custom order, just let us know. It's gonna cost a little bit more, but I can give you some custom stuff. So if you guys need anything, you go to the website. Or if you want custom, you can send me an email. What happened? You had to take it to the room, didn't you? Yeah, and they don't let you use the elevator because you have to have a car. I had to go up all three flights of stairs. See. I thought it was going to be a sweet 525, but it wasn't. But that was, they out of control for that. I just want to let y'all know. They did say leave it at the front desk, though. What happened with that? It doesn't. It says leave it at my door. Oh. So you have to have a car to go in the elevator. Oh, I guess this. What is this? What, what hotel is this? The Marriott or something? Oh, Spring and Hill Suites, I think. Oh, yeah. So Tell that's what happened with that, guys. But let me tell you this. The reason why we. <laughs> I'm going to spit my little game, my little minute out. The reason why we have we have to do it with my business partner because I haven't been cleared yet. Because I, me and my dad got the same last name and my dad passed is a little, you know, <laughs> is a little skeptical. So, because you got to do a background check when you do this. So, I think that they trying to just clear that up. So, I still haven't gotten approved yet. And um, also, another thing that's, that's good about the app is it actually goes by your car size because we had a few orders that were bigger orders like 96 items and stuff like that from uh jewel or walmart that is for more for suv versus me using this car so we couldn't do that one because we didn't have enough room but that was 15 dollars though or 14 dollars or something like that so that was these and you're supposed to just drive and pick up but the one thing i'm starting to notice about the the grocery stores and all that stuff is that you have to go in there you don't just get to pull up and they just put stuff in the car like you know when you do the deliver the thing over over the uh over the app when you had to go in there, you had to find the stuff or they gave you the stuff um they gave it to me but sometimes it takes them a lot of time for them to do that so we're messing up my time then because you know you get extra money when you do it in a timely fashion so did we get some extra money for that one no yeah we got the 525 but you had the exercise though sure did. you had to go up some stairs to that no, but that 525. I mean, it was cool. It was it was the driving part was cool, but you know. But hopefully we get some more soon. I was just telling them this. 
we might get some ones in Gurney. We might have to go to Gurney. You know what I'm saying? Because we kind of in the middle of both. So, we don't know what's going to happen. But it's, it's about to be lunchtime. So, a lot of people probably got tea last night. And they ain't get up. But everything is close by. So, if it was me, I'd just drive myself. But, you know, teach us all. So, after doing some investigation, we have made $19.50 so far. Now, my partner said that this is what we're going to do. Next Saturday, we're going to take her vehicle. We're going to go to Libertyville early in the morning, like you said, 7 or 8. Like 7 or 8, probably 7 in the morning. So after I do my exercise, I'm going to get dressed and then we're going to shoot straight out there. Because they got that that guacamole out there. So it's going to be a little bit different. They got that fettuccine, so we're going to see the difference. We was we were going to go to Libertyville before, but our area, it's like it shows you on after certain areas are hot in, at certain times. So our area had got hot at by the time we had left. So we just stay here. But next Saturday we're gonna go up there. Or we're gonna try something during the week. We're gonna try something during the week around lunchtime. What about that? Try around lunchtime. But it, it's all it really all does all depends on the location and where you are. So if you are in the in the everything is like boom 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 right there, you're gonna make some good money. But nineteen dollars and fifty cent, we've been out here for like hour and a half so at this point i don't think it's worth it for me right now but we're going to try next saturday and see see what see what happens because sometimes you just have to sit a little bit it ain't like you go off the hook crazy like doo -doo 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 -doo. no it ain't you know so i'm thinking it's going to i think it may pick up i don't know because it's lunch time but it is saturday too so i think that it'll probably be better on a weekday versus the weekend i just found out another thing when you we just declined it so we skipped that one so if a lot of drivers keep skipping it, then the money goes. We got another one. For six seventy-five, Walmart nine items. How many miles? One mile. We got to look at this thing because then they may be trying to finesse some time a little. Looks like it's right on top of each other. So yeah. Yeah, we're doing that. Six seventy-five, one mile, nine items. Let's get this money, baby. We were literally across the street, so we have to follow the orange pickup line. So we get to pick this up. We just gonna pick this up in the car this time. They're gonna load it in, the nine items. Yeah, baby. Parking in number three. Parking in number three. Picking this joint up. They looking at the vet ski. I see y'all. They getting this money, y'all. They gonna be driving around in this too. Another thing I can say is, there is no way if you have a vehicle that used to be broke, cause you can do this. All you need is some gas. So there's no excuse. And there's not a limit on how much money you can make either. It's up to you. You're about to come get our order right now. We oh, secure in that bag. Thank you. Uh, huh? Stop? Yeah. I just changed I just changed the uh the tires, stickers, put new tires on it. I'm gonna switch it up next year. I'm gonna get it wrapped and change oh, everything. I'm gonna get it tuned, all that. 305s or 290, 285s? Uh, I couldn't tell you. I got these tire stickers on it. I don't know. If they Somewhere probably right here. I think they're pretty. They're pretty wide. Yeah, they're, yeah, they're pretty they're wide. They're pretty oh, wide. I yeah. have a C6. Oh, you do? Yeah. Yeah. They're nice. I like the C7s. Yeah, thank you. That's my favorite, man. The C8s are cool, but I like the C7s better. Yeah, they're really nice. All right, they're thank nice. you. See, he got a C6. See, that's what I'm trying to say. A C6 Corvette. Don't be judging people just because they work somewhere. He riding around in the van too. Working at Walmart, doing it. Wham. We just made it here. There's a lot of confusion because I went past the place. I had to bust a U-turn in this heavy traffic place, do a U-turn, then I missed the turn and I had to do another U-turn, then do another U-turn, but we're here. So that's all that matters. We're here. I don't know if we got the fast time or not, but that was a good little amount. It was only nine items that you guys saw. But sometimes you guys got to keep in mind that when they say nine items, they may mean nine bags versus just nine items. So we just got that seven dollar tip, baby. So we got nine seventy five. That's what I'm just telling them on the camera, right? So this was the best one though, because it was yeah. literally right there. They loaded it for us. It was only three bags, and it was running, and it was almost ten bucks. The thing is this, though, right? I was thinking that this is gonna be a perfect area because it's the old folks area. Some people can't. Some people can't. We, we got another one. Four twenty five. Uh, for less than a mile. Tropical smoothie. Mm -hmm. Four twenty five. Two items. Two items. Less than a mile. We're going, we're going to get this money, baby. Hopefully, I ain't got to do all these U-turn stuff. But I was telling them, right, 
this might be a perfect look. This might be better than Gurney because the old folks home right here. And a lot of them probably came. Well, they probably got walkers and stuff, or ain't nobody coming to get them to take them. So they could just hit us. Well, wow, man, we got the plug in there now. We got the plug because somebody work in there. We might can really get. We might can. We might can skip DoorDash all together. Just do our own little thing on the side. But yeah, about to go get this tropical smoothie, which is literally right here. Plus, Make she she just told her person that she's training to look up your YouTube channel. And make oh sure yeah, we're about to get some, we're about to get some subscribers. We need some subscribers too. We need it all. New socks and draw. See y'all when we get there. We here. Hopefully, you got this food ready so we can make this 425, baby. With this joint around. See, it's good and it's good to have two. We, we see the one thing about us. We always we split everything. So if, if we make the money, we split the money. But it's a good to have somebody drive and then somebody pick up because it's boop boop in and out, in and out. So the next one, when she drive, when we take the SUV, I'm gonna do all the running. So that's how we doing. We're trying to get this money. I'm gonna say that we could tr possibly make, I wanna try to make $100 today. I don't know, we've been out here for a while, but I think that we got a better location now. So it may work out good for us, we're gonna see. Um, but I'll keep you guys informed about everything. We definitely gonna give you guys a grand total at the end. One more thing I would recommend. I would recommend you first eat breakfast. I haven't eaten breakfast, it's 12 o'clock now. I ain't eat nothing, I've been drinking. That alkaline water, baby. I shouldn't even promote them because they ain't sponsoring this video. For anybody who want to sponsor the video, make sure you go ahead and email me at roamshouseviews at gmail.com or you can even email me at redefinedtb at gmail.com. But I do want to say, you probably should eat breakfast and also if you're not going to be at home, pack a lunch. Because what you don't want to do is go out trying to make money. But if you're spending money while you're trying to make money, it just don't go hand in hand. So you pack your little sandwich, chips, something like that, some light. Pack, you pack your lunch and drive around and get this money because if you don't see like we're a tropical smoothie right now and I already want to buy something because that's my little spot you know that's that stuff be banging if you got something in your area you may want, may, you want to make sure you try it but pack you a lunch that's probably a great idea for you to pack a lunch so you don't spend the money that you're making another thing I just noticed the restaurants can mess up your timing because she been in there for a good like five minutes and they still ain't made this order yet. See, that's what I'm saying. They messing up the timing, which we can make more money if we're faster. So it's possible that we came here too fast. So if another thing I want to say, if you got to wait 20 minutes or something, I'm not, I'm not waiting. I'm sitting here waiting. We can do something else. You know, decline that one and move on to something else. But it's taking a little time to come up with this order. So think about that too. Oh, I just got the message. Just sent the message. They didn't start before we came, so we came too fast. So that's gonna take our time off. We'll see what happens. We are here. Hopefully give us some more money. Tropical Smooth, you gotta get it together, man. You're messing up our time and we were supposed to be getting some more money for this. So what's going on? We still trying to drop off the Tropical Smoothie, but he put the address, but he didn't put the apartment number. He didn't put the apartment number on here. And we don't just want to leave the food right there because we might mess up our score or something. But we did text it and we did call the number. The number doesn't work. So now it's like, are you just supposed to leave or what? We did take the picture and all that stuff. We left it by the door, but I don't know. So if you're doing DoorDash, if, if, you're, if you're the one ordering, make sure you put the apartment number or something because you know, we're just sitting here. She had to ring all the doorbells, yeah. making people dogs barking. And what is this? 1075 for what? Chipotle for nine miles. Oh, they out of their mind. Out of their mind. One of oh, by the way, while we was at a uh, tropical smoothie, one of them was from GameStop. If you're all familiar with the area, from Walking to Kenosha, that's probably 20 miles. I think it said 12, but you got to remember mileage like this is is where they say as the crow flies it's like I don't know if you were means. an airplane or if you were a bird and you flew in this in the air you didn't have traffic you didn't have turns you didn't have yeah shots. i'm not about to drive oh we got another we got a ring 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 baby we're going off the meat rack and oh, express 4.2 miles for 575. no man see the thing is once you get these sweet ones once you get the ones that's 
you know, right around the corner. It's like you don't want to take no, no four miles. And we've taken almost, not even a full mile, probably like, not even, a, probably like a half a mile maybe. But dude finally, he need, he need to be tipping us for that. Had to hawk him down and all that. Bring all the people, uh, disrupt people and they, and they know what they got going on. But anyway, we'll let you go at nice go. When the next one come on, it's going to rain like him pretty soon here. Shit. Excuse, if, I'm not sure if the audio is going to be good or bad, but I do know that I had to, I had to charge the mic because it was real low. So, we got another order for Pop Belly. We have to go two miles, or well, 1.9 miles is the whole trip for $4.75. And we have until 12.57 to do it. We're actually pretty close to Pop Belly. We're probably like a quarter of a mile away. So if we could do it faster, then we could probably get a little bit more money. So that's the plan. Oh yeah, and I got one of these. Tropical smoothie. Gave us some, some energizers. Need some energy. Need some. Cause I haven't eaten still, and it's about to be one o'clock. But I said you gotta pack a lunch. Pack a lunch. So yeah, we're on our way to Pop Billy now. Another thing I would say, don't try to rush too fast to get there because it takes some time to make stuff. Especially the people in Tropical Smoothie. I, don't, I mean, <laughs> I don't even know what to say about them. They ain't even cut this up that good. They ain't even cut this up that good. I still get stuck in the straw. They're in there kicking the bobo. Some girl in there with a friend. And I just got to get it together, man. Get it together in there. That's what I want to say. Let this lady go because I'm in the wrong, wrong joint. See, she playing. She playing. She playing. Whip. Whip game. I didn't put, since we've been doing this, I didn't put 33 miles on my car. So I'm doing it just to make the content. Because believe it or not, I would never in life waste miles on this. So. We here at Pop Belly parking right now. About to go and grab this food. We'll see you guys when we get outside. It's gonna come outside. You know I'm having night and day. Got the food ski. We'll try that as well, girl. Go back to where we just hit. Go back this way. We got that food. We're on the way to go get this 475, baby. We can get 575 or something. See how we get to the house. Here it's kind of suspect because there's no, there's only one car here. Maybe I should go. Get the thing with you. Take your gun with you. Just, if you don't come out in three minutes, coming in blaze. Boom, 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 boom. We are back in the V Head What's that? 750 Walmart, Seven 22 Idle. No, man. I'm not going for a dollar a mile. Oh, it's all the way to Liberty, though. Why would they order? Something from Walmart and walk in and go to Liberty. It doesn't really make sense to me, but hey, to who am I? But I do want to say this. This is like a perfect little thing for teenagers or something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And maybe, I mean, for grown people too, but I think you have to just get the right, you have to be in the right area for it to work out good for you. So it's actually a bunch of office buildings in there. And there's more cars right there. Oh, yeah, in the back, cars and in the back. Was, um, was a doctor. Well, how, how, hopefully, doctor, whatever his name is, give us some extra. She. Oh, here. Hopefully, she give us some more of that money. It literally was down the street, though. They did my, they did, they did my tropical smoothie burger. I can't even drink. Look, man, they in there talking, talking, and all that, playing game. I did five. Had a pocket for that. But we're going back to the location now. We just had them up at 750 at Walmart for that was, that was 11 miles away. Get out of pocket for that on my way. We got that full baby. Okay. Oh no, we can go. Just go which way? Go out and go that way. Go out and then go right. Yes. Right. 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 Hey, anybody who saw to my guy Tyler Bank Army, go subscribe to his YouTube channel. He's a, a rapper. And I'm actually going to talk to him about making the sun so I can be putting his songs in the background of my videos. Like we got the, um, 
the four pretty things that came in the back and all that stuff. So I'm gonna holla at him about that. I'm turning which way. We got oh we so we just did this we started the DoorDash thing yesterday we got the uh, app and everything right he's supposed to send the bag out but we said forget the bag we got the Sam's Club bag we're gonna use that to keep the food warm how much is it for again six six, 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 seven, eight, six. yeah we need that little six that hot six we are having more technical difficulties someone put the wrong address in the address that they put in doesn't even they put. 78 and it's, there is no 78 here on the street so now we have to go to different knock on people, different people's doors to find out who fooled it is that was her four houses later we finally figured out who fooled it was just like that we are back in the vehicle this time it was ready for some reason we had it ready this time Dumbass GPS got us on the wrong side of the street, and it's a, a big street, it's grand. So, for those of you familiar with the area, it's grand. They got us on the wrong side of the street. So, now we have to go back to this light and go all the way across the street. So, I guess you gotta deal with that too. So, we're here back in Granny, right? Which is what supposedly is. What is that? 275. And you didn't go to Walmart? 66 items. For 275? Yeah, I think they're mine. What's wrong with these people, man? It's way more traffic over here, too. So, just by the mall. Bar Mall. If you're not familiar with the area, it's by our mall. So, I'm going, we're going back to where we were just said before. We probably shouldn't have. Oh, oh, by the way, we think we got four more dollars from the people we had dropped up to. Because it said 18 now, jump up to 22. So, got I'm, I'm quite sure it had to be them unless it was somebody else but i think we got four more dollars so what we're going to do is we're going to go back to where we were at we're going to go back to where we were at we're going to get chipotle so we can eat then we're going to try to catch one on the way home for the last one that's that's the plan was this one worth it though was it i think so i don't know it was highway it, it was highway. highway it was highway yes we got to go faster and all that stuff we had to go through all this traffic and everything to get over here, which is not their fault, it's the GPS fault. And if the four dollars was for them, it was like fourteen dollar trip. Fourteen dollar trip for how many miles was it though? Like nine, twelve miles. Oh. It was twelve miles. No, it was nine miles, twelve minutes. I think it was six miles. Uh, you think so? Mm -hmm. So this is actually pretty fun because you try to beat the time and everything, so it's pretty fun. Um, we're gonna go get Chipotle right now. So we're gonna go back to our, I think that place, the other spot is better to me because here they want you to give, they want you to do a lot more for less money. There we went to some spots and got $5 and $4 and some, and we got a $7 tip. That was, I mean, that was the best one we had so far today. So, how much we got for this? Because we stopped it and then started again because we were going to eat before. But we didn't want to miss the crunch time. But it's about almost 2 o'clock now. So, we're about to go get food. But if something come up, I ain't going to lie. One thing about me, that money keep calling me. That money called me and I got to go. So, we're running late for this. We're not even, we didn't even get the food yet. It's terrible. This traffic is critical. Like, and it's been like this for at least how many minutes? Like five minutes. Yeah. Everybody trying to go. Trying to go to the fright. What it's called? Fright Fest. The Fright Fest. At Six Flags. We, we shouldn't have came this way. But it is what it is. Traffic. Traffic. Looking for my chapstick. There's a four man. <laughs> we literally just got here. That traffic is critical. I didn't know nothing about the Fright Fest. I didn't know it was a big thing. I don't really like Six Flags myself because I don't really do hikes, but it's crazy. It's super crazy. So that's what's going on there. We're for sure we're wait. We're gonna be way late. So hopefully they don't give us like I don't know if they go by stars or anything. Hopefully they don't give us any of that. But we're gonna see. We actually had about 53 miles now that we've drove today. 
the gas is one notch above half and honestly it's not it's not bad to do honestly i i would i wouldn't mind doing it you know you just take some time chill relax and just do this he's trying to look at the car he almost hitting somebody but not that bad make sure you bring a lunch and other than that it should be good she's about to get in the car for food i'm about to drop this food off hopefully we do not have to go that way hopefully there's a way to get out of this traffic because the traffic is red ten Cold. See, you just dropped off the sub, Wizzle. What is that one? We're not, it wants us to go back past Six Flags, I think. We're not, we're, we're absolutely not going back to Six Flags. That's not happening. I'm avoiding it at all costs. So, now we're going to try to make our way to Chipotle and let some juicy come pop up. We're definitely not going back that way. It's not worth it. We were already late to that one, very late. Probably like, how many, like 10 minutes at least? 15 minutes? But it wasn't our fault. It's traffic. So they did the right thing about getting DoorDash. So we got the Chipotle, as you guys can see in the back. We just got one and then ring, ring, ring. We just wrong for Buffalo Wild Wings for how much is it? 725 for how many miles? Four point some miles, but it's going towards home. So we're going to take this one. It's going to be our last one once we're done. Time is 2:35. I think that it's a good thing to do in your spare time. It'd be way better if we were using like a regular car to this winter. I'm an idiot. Tweet. If we were using a regular car, like if we use like if you had like a little Honda or like even a Prius, Prius would get you together. You can make good money in a Prius. I also believe that you have to come out a certain time. A certain time is going to be more than other times. And it probably depends on the day too and the location. So everything matters. Look at here. We are buff we're pulling the Buffalo Wild Wing, right? Buffalo Wild Wing. Pulling there right now. What up? And we're back. We got the Buffalo Wild Wing. So I go out the way I came in or close straight? Then turn right. It doesn't matter. You're going to Waukegan Road. We're going towards home, so. Okay, yeah. Get busy going here. Even though I'm turning on the wrong side of the thing. Drop this buffalo wild wings off. Yeah. Eat the Chipotle and relax for the rest of the day. Smoke oak. Relax for the rest of the day. But yeah. I think this, I, honestly, I don't mind doing this. There's not nothing I would mind because you get to be by yourself if you want to be. If you don't want to be bothered with nobody, you can just boop, boop. Do this by yourself in your spare time, you know, as long as you keep some gas in your car. See, people just over here tweaking, man. This why, come on, dude, why would you do that? Yo, Goofy, y'all be, which, which one I'm going? Uh, I missed the light playing with y'all. You gotta deal with a lot of goofballs, so just keep that in mind. Um, keep the mind the time of the day, because you might have to deal with some traffic like we had to deal with. I didn't know about the Fright Fest. If I did, I wouldn't never went that way. But all in all, I think it's I think it's kind of decent. How much we made so far? Or okay. oh, you can't see it. Well, after we after we drop this off, I'm gonna talk to you guys. Oh, let's see, I know y'all see that y'all see that person walk in the back. Keep your eyes up. But anyway, <laughs> I'll let you guys know how much we made today. And yes, I will. I'm actually going to try to do it. We're going to we're going to try next week. Uh, we're going to see the difference in how much money. Because the girl I was watching, I'm not sure her name, but huge shout out to her. Once I find out her name, I'll let you guys know. Huge shout out to her. I was watching her do DoorDash on YouTube. That's how I even thought about doing all this. But she was making like eighty some, a hundred dollars a day sometimes. So, but she had like a lot of like orders like McDonald's, Burger King, Taco Bell, stuff like that. KFC. We had a few grocery grocery runs. But I do think this is going to be a good location. But we have to see once we go to Libertyville where they got that guacamole. We're going to get on the strip at their main strip area where they got like Whole Foods and all that stuff. Early in the morning, I think it would be good. Also, we got to kind of figure out what time of the day would be best. So we got to figure that out too. This like takes forever. See you guys. Let's see. Whipping up right now. Well, this one. the right address. Back up, stop. They 
ってですね。ですね。They had the mailbox. They took with the mailbox. Or、oh, maybe it's both of them on the same side. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. We here. The last one. I must say, it wasn't that bad. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you like me doing this type of stuff, make sure you smash that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed. Also, smash the like button if you do like the video. I also want you guys to comment below and let me know if you, like, if you want me to continue to do this to see how much we can really make. Maybe I can do, maybe if you guys like it, maybe I can do a how much you would make in one week type of thing. If you do it kind of full time, I'm not going to do a full, full time. We could, uh, Just comment below and let me know how many hours you want me to do it and how long you want me to do it. I mean, like as far as weeks or time or, you know, days or however many, how long you want me to do that. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Again, if you're looking to get some of the merch, go to redefinetb.com and grab the merch. Also, if you're looking to buy certain new properties, you can always email me at romeshouseofviews at gmail.com. I'll see you guys on the next one. It's real to Rome. And I'm gone, baby.